This is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com at the 2019 uh, Casey Cares uh, show at the Classic Auto Mall in Morgantown. We're checking out a 71 Saab Sister, Sister being the station wagon version. This is the front wheel drive V4. They used a German Ford V4 engine for this car. I absolutely love these for a very good reason. I learned to drive on the 68 Saab Sister. This is just such of a cool car. I absolutely, as I said, let's take a look at the stickers. This is the original owner. And he's got the original Moroni, so we'll take go through. Uh, it's got the dual brake system, uh, power assist front brakes. We didn't have that in our Saab on the 68. Uh, it goes through electric clock. Uh, the original price was $2,667. Uh, Optional was a tinted glass, fold down rear seat. Yes, this is a three seater. Uh, overriders, the other. Total price is $28,440. AM radio was $85. This car also has air conditioning. Uh, but what's interesting, 64 Dodge Dart four door uh, was traded for $3, $533. Now we're going to take a complete walkabout of this really cool little wagon. Yes, you can actually pull with this. We pulled a camper, a very small camper, nice 65 bird in the back. Could you open the rear door? I'd love to show off the rear seat. <laughs> this was so much fun riding back here. Of course, facing backwards. You had a lot of room because remember with front wheel drive, you could do things like this. The kids love it. Oh, the kids love it. They, they, they fit back here fine. And then when you put everything down, it's really a lot of room. That is neat. Could you open the door and the hood for me, please? Okay. Okay. It had this had this seat like that back there, but there was no arrangements, no no place for spare tire or anything else. Now the one thing which always drove me crazy is look at the offset of the pedals. But full thing I see the air conditioning down there. Look at where the radio is mounted. You actually cut a hole in the glove box. Really cool. This is a nice car. These are really pretty cool to drive too. Again, front wheel drive. Now, check this out. This is the V4 over here. Again, it's a Ford V4. See how far it's mounted actually in front. This little Camaro in front of the transmission. Transmission's right back there and the drive uh, to the front wheels. But it's such a compact design, it is remarkable. Just remarkable. I'm going to zoom around to the other side. Hang on, bear with me. Thank you. You can see what goes on over there. Again, notice how compact this is. You can still reach everything. These cars were just phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. Now, of course, you remember the earlier ones, 67 earlier, uh, were three cylinder, two cycles. Again, the same arrangement with the motor up front. The uh, V4 was uh, done because they could not get the uh, three-cylinder pass emissions test. Now, why don't they make a V4 today? That's a beautiful motor. Now, you said that you bought this brand new? I bought a brand new, 1971. What? Wow. Took it on my honeymoon with my wife. Oh, nice! Took Canada, and we've taken it with a uh, four, well, three children to uh, Florida. Oh, very good. From, uh, from here. That's from great. Here. So. That is great. So they grew up in the car too. Oh yeah, facing, oh. facing backwards. Of course. Way so. for the people. <laughs> oh, so. that that was half the fun with these station wagons, yeah. uh, with the rear seats. That's fun. Now, what did you tow with the car? I have a little trailer. Uh huh. Just a little trailer. Very good. That I need. It, it's got two hundred thousand on it. Oh my gosh, so, that's great. Same engine. Uh huh. You know, transmission's been changed out a little bit. Yeah. Same engine. Yeah, these things are bulletproof. I just remember that uh, mom's ate clutches, but that was probably because both my brother and I learned to drive on it. Yeah, my two, two of my three learned to ride in it. Yeah. 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 Six oh. shift and everything. So. This is great. 
Now, of course, this is a four-speed on a column. Yes. And I'm not going to give away the secret of how to put it into reverse. <laughs> but if you see a sob owner, you have to buy them a drink to find out how to put it into reverse. This is simple. <laughs> yeah. We won't, we won't reveal it here. Okay. We're going to leave some mysteries. This is great. Absolutely great. Who put the air conditioning in? There is no air conditioning. Oh, I thought you had air conditioning no. because of the vents the down below. There we go. That's good enough. I like that. 50-50 air conditioning. Yeah, it's different than the 68. There are some uh, minute differences. Yes. But uh, still the same Saab. I love it. Just love it. You also have power assist brakes where on this the 68. Yeah, the uh, 68 didn't. So. This is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com at the 2019 Car Show. Casey Cares Car Show at the Classic Auto Mall over here in Morgantown for more cool events like this. Make sure you check NortheastWheelsEvents.com. Can you put the hood down? SoutheastWheelsEvents.com, UKWheelsEvents.com. And while you're there, post and share your events. I'll see you at the shows. Now, was that great? There we go, there's a perfect parting shot.